Today's video is sponsored by NordVPN. Wealth and power are two sides of the same coin, particularly for kings who, historically speaking, have had access to immense fortunes from their control over lands and resources. So let's take a look at some pretty serious bank accounts, past king style. I'm Mike with List25, and from taxation powers to booming trade deals, here's our list of 25 richest kings in history. But before we begin, don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe, and think about joining our Discord. We're always talking there. Oh, and uh, what would you do if you had all this wealth? Let us know in the comments below. With that being said, let's go. Twenty-five, Emperor Meiji. Emperor Meiji, also known as Emperor Mutsuhito, was the 122nd Emperor of Japan and reigned from 1867 to 1912. He's known for modernizing Japan and transforming the country into a significant world power. Meiji honorably distributed his extravagant wealth to help those he served. Some of his projects included establishing a modern education system, promoting industrial development, and expanding the country's infrastructure, including constructing new roads, railroads, and ports. 24. Mswati III King Mswati III is the current ruler of the African nation of Swaziland, a small landlocked country located in southern Africa. Since 1986, he's been leading the kingdom, assuming the throne after his father, King Subuza II's death. As the reigning monarch, Mswati III has access to all of Swazi monarchy's wealth and resources, which includes properties and assets worth hundreds of millions of dollars. In fact, his personal net wealth is estimated to be between $200 million and $500 million. His reign has seen a series of positive changes, including economic development coupled with major strides in healthcare and education, making him an admired leader among Swazis as well as internationally. And speaking of kings who could do whatever they want and had tons of people to protect them, you also need a bunch of protection whenever you surf the internet. And no one does it better than today's sponsor, NordVPN. The internet can be an amazing place, but there are also a lot of dangers out there. I'm sure you know that people will try to steal your passwords, but there are also so many other types of cyber attacks that are lurking in the shadows. Man in the middle attacks, phishing scams, DDoS, malware, malvertising, and ransomware, just to name a few. But you don't need to worry about any of those when you get NordVPN which you can get with our personal link, nordvpn.com slash list. With NordVPN, you get online protection with just a single click. Their threat protection shields you from malware, trackers, and ads. Their dark web monitor lets you know if someone leaks your credentials. MeshNet allows you to connect to your devices remotely and securely. Dedicated IP helps you avoid captures and block lists. Doesn't that all sound great? I mean, isn't it nice to know that you can surf the web at peace? like a surfer just relaxing on their board out in the middle of the ocean, not worrying about all those sharks. That's a simile. And like I said before, you can get all of that peace of mind by checking out our link, nordvpn.com slash list. And you might think that that is all that NordVPN does, but oh, oh, oh dear viewer, you would be wrong. Do you like traveling? Like watching stuff online, but hate those pesky region locks? Why, when I went to Singapore, Korea, and Japan, there were several shows I couldn't access that I was right in the middle of binging. Had I had NordVPN, I wouldn't have had to wait two and a half weeks to continue my shows. Do you know how much you can forget in two and a half weeks? And some of my shows don't even come with those little recaps at the beginning of each episode. NordVPN, on top of all that security, allows you to select region servers from around the world so you can leave home without leaving behind your content. So what are you waiting for? Get all the protection you need and stop leaving behind the content you want by heading to our link nordvpn.com slash list and get four extra months free. Also, they have a 30 day money back guarantee, so it's risk free. Now back to the list. 23, Amenhotep III. Ushered in by the successful rule of his father, Amenhotep III inherited Egypt at its prime, rich with resources and abundant prosperity. To celebrate this bounty, he initiated several spectacular architectural feats to showcase Egyptian grandeur, namely the Temple of Amun at Karnak and Soleb's glorious temple, whose design dazzled for eons as symbols of strength and regality. Eons, really. That's a long time. 22. Pumibol Aduya De. Pumibol Aduya De was the previous king and the father of the current king of Thailand, who 
spoilers. We'll get to later. Ranma the Ninth, which is how Thailand names slash numbers their kings each dynasty, was one of the world's wealthiest monarchs with a personal fortune estimated at around $30 billion, primarily deriving from grand real estate investments owned by the Brown Property Bureau. 21. Louis XIV. King Louis XIV, also known as the Sun King, was the King of France from 1643 to 1715. He inherited a large fortune and a number of valuable properties and assets upon his accession to the throne. Louis was known for his extravagant and opulent lifestyle, which included the construction of the Palace of Versailles, a lavish residence and center of power for the French monarchy. 20. Henry VIII King Henry VIII was one of England's most famous rulers, whose reign spanned from 1509 to 1547. He had immense wealth and power, which he used to leave a powerful mark on the religious landscape by spearheading the separation of the Church of England away from Rome, now known as the English Reformation. His personal fortune grew over time, due in part to his many successful military campaigns and diplomatic efforts, not forgetting his multiple marriages with wealthy noble women. That'll do it. 19. Mohammed VI King Mohammed VI rules Morocco with a wealth of influence and riches. After succeeding his father, Hassan II, in 1999, he established himself as one of the wealthiest kings on the continent with an estimated net worth between $2.1 and $8.2 billion. His reign is sure to continue for years to come, ensuring that Morocco remains under strong leadership and guidance into its future prosperity. 18. Grand Duke Henry Grand Duke Henry has been at the helm of Luxembourg since ascending to the throne in 2000, following his father's abdication. His vast personal wealth, estimated between four to five billion dollars, has been amassed through investments across multiple sectors like agriculture, forestry, and renewable energy projects, as well as property development. 17. Charles Philip Arthur George Charles Philip Arthur George is the firstborn of Queen Elizabeth II and Prince Philip, and will ascend to the throne in 2022 following his mother's passing. Oh, hey, he is now. So this was written before. Guess what? He is currently it. We did it. Good luck, everyone. He comes from a line of wealth. I meant good job. Good luck. I guess good luck. He comes from a line of wealth with an estimated net worth reaching $600 million. This lucky prince has capitalized on many ventures, ranging from agricultural businesses to renewable energy initiatives. In addition, he supports young people through the Prince's Trust Program, which is probably going to be renamed the King's Trust Program, or already has been, as well as sustainable development worldwide via the Prince's Foundation. Again, probably now the King's Foundation. 16. Felipe VI Felipe VI is the reigning king of Spain and has sat on the throne since 2014. In response to calls for more transparency in his royal house, he revealed a net worth of 2.6 million euros, an unusual show by any monarch's standards. The Spanish monarchy had been criticized previously due to its lack of openness during Juan Carlo I's reign, highlighted by allegations against him that shone a spotlight on the just how financially shady things were becoming under his rule. 15. Salman Abdulaziz bin Saud King Salman of Saudi Arabia is the current ruler, having taken up the mantle after his brother's death in 2015. His incredible wealth, estimated at upwards of $18 billion, comes from investments, including real estate and business ventures that have made him one of the richest monarchs in history. 14. Sultan Hassan al Bolkiah Sultan Hassan al Bolkiah has been the leader of Brunei since 1967, making him one of the longest ruling monarchs in history. As head of state, he presides over all branches of government and is estimated to be worth between 20 and 28 billion dollars. His wealth earned through investments like real estate and business ventures. By any standard, His Majesty's five decades on the throne have made a remarkable impact, not just within Brunei, but across borders too. 13. Maha Vahira Rangkon Maha Wahila Rangkon King Rama X of Thailand, born as Maha Wahira Rangkon, is a wealthy monarch whose vast fortune has been amassed through shrewd investments in real estate and business. As the current reigning sovereign since 2016 and taking over after his father's death, his estimated wealth ranges between 30 and 43 billion dollars. 12. Muammar al Gaddafi Muammar al-Gaddafi was the leader of Libya, who held an iron grip of power from 1969 until 2011. 
His controversial policies shaped not only his country, but had reverberations across the region. He exerted control over a great portion of Libya's oil wealth and resources. This allowed him to fund ambitious projects while maintaining absolute authority within Libyan borders through its military forces. 11. William the Conqueror of Normandy William the Conqueror, otherwise known as William I of England, was no ordinary leader. As Duke of Normandy and King of England, he ruled a large region in northern France, with access to valuable resources such as land and mines that gave him great wealth. However, his most notable conquest came when he successfully invaded Britain in 1066, leading to what's now famously known today as the Norman Conquest, an event which would forever change English history. 10. Nizam Mir Osman Ali Khan Nizam Mir Osman Ali Khan, otherwise known as Asaf Jah VII, ruled India's princely state of Hyderabad between 1911 and 1948. During his reign, he gained a notable reputation for his immense wealth, living an extravagant lifestyle that saw him become one of the world's richest men at the time, with an estimated personal fortune of around $2 billion. His assets included vast estates and palaces across India, evidence enough to testify just how luxurious life under this ruler was. 9. Tsar Nicholas II Tsar Nicholas II was the last of a dynastic line that had presided over an enormous Russian empire for centuries. Descended from kings, he wielded immense wealth and influence during his reign, not to mention access to coveted assets belonging to his Romanov family. This, however, all came crashing down when power finally shifted away in 1917 with his abdication from office at long last signaling the end of imperial rule. 8. King Solomon of Israel King Solomon was a powerful ruler and renowned for his wealth, wisdom, and incredible construction projects. He built the first temple in Jerusalem, while trading luxury commodities like gold, silver, and precious stones to accumulate an immense fortune, earning him tribute from foreign nations. His accomplishments during his reign remain impressive even today. 7. Akbar I Akbar I was an extraordinary figure in Indian history. The Mughal Emperor, commonly known as Akbar the Great, ruled a vast and expansive empire from 1556 to 1605 that included rich agricultural lands, mines, lucrative trade routes, but it wasn't just his territory that he was remembered for. He also left behind a trove of gold, silver, and precious jewels collected through military campaigns which funded various projects during his reign, establishing him not only as one of India's greatest rulers but also its most influential ruler ever. 6. Abdullah il bin al Hussein King Abdullah il bin al Hussein is the reigning monarch of Jordan, who comes from one of the Middle East's most prominent royal families. Boasting a vast fortune between $1 and $5 billion, he has acquired much wealth through investments in real estate and other businesses while also having full access to his family lineage's assets, making him some serious dough. 5. Genghis Khan Genghis Khan, or as they actually pronounce it in Mongolian, Genghis Khan, was a formidable force of the 13th century. He founded and became leader of the Mongol Empire, which went on to become one of history's largest empires after his death. Not only did he show exceptional prowess as an astute statesman, but also possessed immense wealth by that era's standards, not just through what he inherited from leading such a vast kingdom, but with personal assets comprising land holdings and buildings too. Four. Alan Rufus. Alan Rufus, otherwise known as Alan the Red due to, you know, his hair being red, bonus points for originality guys, was the wealthiest person in British history. When he died at the age of 53 in 1093, he was worth, in today's money, 81 billion pounds, or 136.85 billion US dollars. He also owned 250,000 acres across Cambridgeshire, London, Norfolk, Northamptonshire, Suffolk, and Yorkshire. How did he acquire such wealth, you may ask? Was he hardworking? Surely he must have been a financial genius. Well, it was given to him by his uncle, William the Conqueror, for squashing the Saxon Rebellion in the North. Hard work really pays off. 3. Emperor Shenzong Emperor Shenzong was an impressive leader of the Song Dynasty, remembered for his patronage of the arts and appreciation for reform. With Xiao Shu's powerful rule spanning from 1067 to 1085, he transformed this dynasty into a prosperous powerhouse that many Chinese look back on with admiration today. 
Two, Augustus Caesar. Augustus was one of the most influential figures in world history. Not only did he have access to all that Rome had accrued, but his own personal wealth included a number of grand villas and palaces spread across the empire, from Herculaneum's Villa of the Papyri to Rome's Palace of Caesars. Definitely no penny pinching here. He set standards for extravagance during his reign as emperor, which still resonate today. 1. Mansa Musa Mansa Musa was a ruler of the Kingdom of Mali in West Africa during the 14th century. Mansa Musa's wealth was legendary, and he's often described as one of the richest individuals in history. He is said to have had a personal fortune of around 400 tons of gold, and he's credited with helping to make Mali one of the wealthiest and most powerful empires in West Africa. So, once again, what would you do if you had all of that wealth? Let us know in the comments below. Like, share, comment, subscribe, do all of that stuff. And as always, I love you guys, and I'll see you next time. Be sure to click that subscribe button Everybody and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Share them with your friends and help us consistently conciliate curiosity. And if you want even more lists, check out these videos here or just head to our website at list25.com.